Now, the Christians are using the Jews. And the Jews are using everybody. Because they are thin, their protocol is to rule the entire world. And they cannot do it until they re-establish the structure of Suleiman. Remember, I have said it about. That's why they keep on trying to dig and, dem and destruct the masjid, the Bayt al maqdis because they want to destroy and build it, as they think. They say that unless this happens, we are, the Antichrist is not going to come. They see that Antichrist, it is in their book, and they accept it, that Antichrist is the one who is going to come and then take them to victory and they will start to rule the whole world. Knowing the history of Jews, knowing even today of what they do, we know that this, this condition was very essential and important because they continuously, not only in the time of Rasulullah even before, when their own prophets came, such as Musa salam, Harun salam, Lut salam, Isa salam, before that and after, uh, we know that what they were doing, they killed prophets, they never obeyed any prophets. They would pr obey some of them, in, par uh, in particular for a certain amount of time, and then they start to disobey and continuously. Subhanallah, they, uh, I doubt there is an ummah which is worse than this ummah from the entire creation of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as far as the human beings are concerned. There is nobody worse than Banu Israel. Wallahu al -musta'an. No woman can dare to step out without the permission of her husband. Regardless of whoever you are, wherever you are. Simple as that. If you know how much they hate us, you would never have a single moment in your life where you would rest. But you would be fully awake, finding out ways to defend and protect the honor which Allah has given you. And there is no other better honor than the honor of Islam which Allah has given you. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala made it very clear when he said لَتَجِدَنَّ أَشَدَّ النَّاسِ عَدَاوَةً لِلَّذِينَ آمَنُوا الْيَهُودَ وَالَّذِينَ أَشْرَكُوا That you will see that those who are the most severe enemies of Muslims are those who call themselves Jews. And then if you have the belief after that that it's okay to be a Christian, okay to be a Jew, okay to be a Hindu, everybody have their rights to be whatever they are and they are going to go to Jannah, then you are not a Muslim, 100%.